Today on Whiteboard Leadership, we're talking about another distinctive of a leadership culture. This is one of my favorites because it's the one I face almost every single day. Uh, and in our church, we had lots of, lots of problems. Maybe your church doesn't have that, but ours had a whole bunch. And so we had to decide how to posture ourselves, how to think about problems in the church. And our statement was this, we live on the solution side of every issue. Here's what we meant by that. <laughs> there are always problems and it's easy to point out the problems of a church. And in fact, probably every Sunday morning, if you're a pastor, you, you hear about the problems of the church. The parking isn't good or the music is too loud or I didn't like what you said about this. You hear about the problems. And we figured out that anyone in the church can point out a problem. It's the job of leadership not to point it out, but to, but to solve it. And yet for most of us, we always have to go through this progression of moving from, moving from being a, um, people who see the problems to people who solve the, the, the problems. And so you have different kinds of people in your leadership in your church. Uh, and what we've got here is a, a chart that talks about the capacity as well as the focus of people in the church. Uh, some are very high focused on, on problems. Um, they may not be high at solving the problem, but they're high at focusing the problem. This person typically has a victim mentality. Uh, it's woe is me, and, and they're, they're, able to, they're, they're pessimistic. They always see the, the, the glass half empty. They are always complaining about things. And um, that kind of person is definitely in your church, and they're in my church, but they shouldn't be on your leadership team, and they're not on my leadership team. Anyone can have a victim mentality. And there are other people that are, are kind of, they see, they see the problems, but they, their, their solution sidedness matches up uh, with, with their, the, the pro size of the problems. And they, they, try to, they try to figure it out. And what they realize is that, okay, I, I've got a small problem, but I'm, 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 I'm responsible for it. And so they become, they become owners. They may not have high capacity for solving, but they're the problems and the responsibility match together. And so they, be, they become owners. Listen, what, they ask, what's my part in this? And, and how can I help resolve the problem? And so they become, become owners. And, and so in effect, they're, they're moving from being victims to becoming, to becoming owners. The next level is those people who are, who are high on the solution side. Maybe they don't even have a, have a great ownership in the problem, but they, but they have a high capacity to solve problems. And so they're willing to help others solve it. So we're gonna call that person a solver, and so uh, when someone has high capacity, you, uh, you, you, you try to help people solve their, their issues. This person is a consultant, they're a counselor, they're an intervener, and they, they love to help people move forward in progress in solving issues. They, they live on the solution side, no question about it. But the right kind of leader will not just attack the small problems, They'll also attack the, the big problems, the high level problems. They have a high capacity uh, to, for them and they have a high focus on them. Uh, this person is just called a leader. A, a leader's job is to help people move forward, to recognize the barriers, the obstacles, the issues, and to find, uh, find the solutions for those things. To trust God, to trust the wisdom of a multitude of leadership and move forward and not let the problems stop them. See, the, this is the thing about ministry. We will always have issues. There'll be large issues and small issues. The job of leadership is to move the big rocks out of the way so the people of God can move forward in the opportunities that God has given them. We live on the solution side of every issue. This has been a Converge Whiteboard Leadership Moment. To learn more about Converge or to join us, check out converge.org.